And that story broke just before 5 o'clock this evening. Bakersfield Police announcing it has closed the investigation into accusations of sexual misconduct against beloved Bakersfield priest Monsignor Craig Harrison. Just 30 minutes later, for the first time, we heard from Harrison himself. 17's Karen Hua is here now with what he had to say. Karen? Well, in the past three months, Monsignor Craig Harrison has been investigated by the Diocese of Fresno, Fireball Police, Merced Police, and Bakersfield Police on allegations from decades ago. Little has been released about the accusations, and it's unclear how many possible victims have filed reports. These past months, waiting for the truth to be revealed, the false allegations to be refuted, my good name to be restored, have been some of the most difficult and challenging experiences of my, of my life. Monsignor Craig Harrison was extremely emotional as he read a brief statement surrounded by family. I've been defamed, I've been slandered, libeled, and irreparably harmed. In May, Bakersfield police started investigating an allegation of sexual battery that occurred in the early 90s. Now, BPD says the statute of limitations has expired. And even if it hadn't, they did not find sufficient evidence to pursue charges against Harrison. But I realize, too, that the battle's not over. While the case in Bakersfield is closed, the cases in Merced and Firebaugh are not. We're absolutely confident that fireball like the other agencies will close this case and there'll be no charges while no one has responded to our calls yet two weeks ago fireball police confirmed their investigation into claims from multiple men was still very active i can't actually tell you the motives of people but there's a pattern of monetizing claims against the church. The Merced District Attorney's Office told us over a month ago that while police have completed their investigation, prosecutors are waiting until neighboring law enforcement agencies finish theirs to make a decision on charges. I am not saying that abuse of clergy members does not occur. I've dedicated my life to serving the vulnerable. I've counseled victims of clergy abuse. As for what happens now, I'm hopeful that I will soon be restored as pastor of St. Francis Church, where I believe I can best serve the community I love so much. The Diocese of Fresno released a statement late this afternoon that reads in part, quote, Monsignor Harrison's status will remain the same while Fireball Police Department and Merced Police Department investigations continue. The diocese is, is unable to make further comment at this time. In studio, I'm Karen Waugh, 17 News.